Ready? Right. One, two, three. three. That was low energy. Let's get some energy in that. Let's All go, right. let's go. Everybody, one, two, three. I'm gonna do it too. You don't have to, but they'll be ready to do Okay. All right, let's go. All right. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. <laughs> We go. Hey guys, all right, today we're so excited because one, we're back at Eden. <laughs> the best place on earth to do all of your creative work. So get in here, get in here, get in here. Tell your mother, tell your dog, tell your family, tell your friends. It's lit, okay? All right, we have a special guest. I gotta check that out because she's so bomb, so bomb. So illustrious, so <laughs> black, so beautiful, so blessed. Oh, she she and she's a real mom. I'm real. Gonna, she's hey, a what? I'm really gonna, yeah. Take she, uh, Okay. Pay, you gonna pay start work. that hot? I'm gonna set me off. <laughs> we have with us today, Stacy. Yes. Okay, girl, how you doing? How you feeling? We feel nice. Right. We feel good. How y'all feeling? We're for good. Great. Do you want to share a little bit about what you do? What you yeah. Do? Yeah. 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 Who you is? Who you from? So I'm one, two. <laughs> you better. They got to say no. I'm bad. I'm bad. I'm bad. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm to know. Um, How long have you been modeling? I'll say three years. Three years? Yeah. Three years in the business. Available for booking? Always. Oh, you can start a um, right Zip underscore God is three S's. Yes. You know? He was in my bio. Was me. <laughs> yes. Now, can we plug? We can plug that in, right? Oh, Honestly, okay. it should be All right. She's super duper outspoken, and this is why she's here today because we love this energy on our podcast, and you know we always with real. So let's get into it. We're all excited for today's topic because it's gonna be a good time. Where the excitement is, right? Yeah. So you know. I was coming across a little video and this particular individual was saying that they are cool with all of their exes and you know, they have like amicable relationships with them and <laughs> they don't block, they don't remove because you can be friends with hmm. your exes. It doesn't have to be that way. So I thought a little, a little on it, you know? Yeah. And I was like- You too? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Uh, her, let's reverse that shit. <laughs> um, I thought about it. I was like, you know what? Let's talk about it. How do you guys feel about friendships with your exes? Mm -hmm. Is it something that like is like, yeah, cool? Or does it depend on different situations? I'm gonna let Stacey get into it first because you're the guest. Ladies first. Um, I would say it depends. But mm -hmm. mm -mm -mm. mm -hmm. Oh, After what I do, <laughs> hell no, <laughs> hell no, what? no, <laughs> no. What it depends on the breakup, how long y'all was together, the bond, everything. Like, so that depends if they stay, if you're in communication with them or not, right? So, like, if it was a bad, good breakup. bond, you could hang out. Well, do you hang out, or do you just yet. communicate? What is the ex? Hold on, Ooh. hold that question. Okay, 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 okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Let's back it up. Let's... So you said it depends on how yes. you guys broke up. Yeah. If you're gonna be friends. How long y'all were together, right. bond and everything. Cause some people could fake it, you know what I mean? Fake it till you make it. True, true. All right, yeah. So when you, I'm gonna come Okay, okay. Cause Ooh. I wanna say something okay. So how do you feel? You say yes or no? I, I can have a problem with that. Okay. You do! That's the problem! <laughs> oh, yeah. Let's get into it. I'm you gonna... have a problem with this? I mm. thought he would have been like, sure, I don't see why two people can't get What voice is that? What voice is that? Yo! <laughs> Go ahead, so wait, why, what? That just, I, let me I'm tell you why I have a problem with this. Mm. This, this dude, when I was like 18 or 19, right, we were going to trade school back in Trinidad, mm. and he made a statement. He said, he, an, let me just make a statement. He said, the reason why you'll never be with a girl who has a, a baby daddy is because that guy is probably doing just one or two things wrong. If he fixes that, she's ready to go back with him. And that, that shit always that stays is with me. Bad. Always oh stays with me. <laughs> that, I was like, that shit is deep, right? So the reason- I'm not even thinking that first. 
That's valid. So what? one of the reasons is like that you're not so together true. for a reason, right? Yes, but if he fix that reason, y'all will be together. Exactly. So forget the baby part. And the podcast. That's it. Right. Because <laughs> what? Yeah, because like, it's like, y'all cool, right? Why do you even break up? That was always my mm. thought. That's why I don't like it. Because it's like if y'all is friends, if you feel and cool, if but it's why not, you not if it's if it's if it's not Stay infidelity, <laughs> but some people are better apart. I'm not gonna lie. Like meaning what? You're toxic together? Yes. It's, but then, I guess that's kind of yeah. that's kind of that's okay. Then it then it's like you with them. What was the benefit? If they're toxic, was it just good sex? Was it just good? Yeah, they make you laugh. You know, uh, in between, between the baby. <laughs> <laughs> Right, well that's, to me that's even more dangerous. Let me tell you why. Mm -hmm. Because y'all break her for 2.5 seconds and she want a little something, she going back to that's that spanking. Y'all quiet. Else, or somebody else, you never know. Yeah, but- the, But is it no women? Mm -hmm. If it's a guaranteed mm -hmm. good time, you rather do that than somebody new. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's you that? know what I'm saying? Because you don't got to make enough. You know. What you know. It's just like, mm -hmm. I don't want to risk you with Tommy over here. Right. I don't know what's going on. Right. Yeah. But, so but I know for a fact, mm -hmm. if I do this, right. it's going to be great. And that's why I have a problem with that. <laughs> split, 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 split. <laughs> that's why I have a problem with people have being cool with their exes. Like, yo, you ever think about exes who break up for no reason? No that's reason scary. is crazy. I don't get yeah. that. Yeah. It's happy. But it they happy. be saying that, like, oh, we just agreed that it right. would be better. Probably it's like, no. No, but they, they for real yeah. don't have that's anything where they're like, yeah, that's, that's like tough that. because it's like. If you don't know why you broke up, then y'all can get back together. Exactly. Because there's no reason. Mm -hmm. there's no reason. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know. Because I feel like it's so. That's like so walking stupid. around with somebody <laughs> having a gun behind your head. And you're not sure, bro. Because it's true. That shit could go off any time. It's like, it's scary. Wait, what were you saying? Oh, go ahead, sir. Who, me? Yeah. What you saying? About what I just said. Yo, I smoke. Please. Yeah! That's why I'm just now. I will never come back. Um, okay, so I personally don't like it because in my head, it's like, what is the point? Right. It's like, what's the point? Y'all had your time. Mm. You were together. Let's say in your case, you're saying it depends on the years oh, and how you right. were or whatever. Yeah. So let's assume it's y'all just uh, deciding you're better apart, whatever. Yeah, whatever. And y'all been together like five years. In my mind, I feel like the only reason why y'all won't just dead it completely is because there's something that you're holding on to. The both of y'all, <laughs> there is something <laughs> y'all holding on to. Because I don't understand if you're better apart, then you should be uh, yeah. apart. And then you bring so much excuses, like, well, I and get to know the family, memories. and I know the mother, she still calls me over <laughs> to water the plants. Memories like, of bending me over. What? Now we're just <laughs> we're friends, but it's like I personally believe I'm gonna take it even further. I feel like anybody you had sexual intercourse with, you are not. That's done. You're not a friend at that point. There is no friendship because you crossed the line. There's no friend. I mean, that's outside of one night stands, though, right? Even if Stacey and I are friends and we smack, we're not, now we're not just friends. Even if You're we never go friends. back to it, even if we never go back to because it, we cross the boundary. You cross the boundary, you can't go back now. You can't go back. I feel that, I feel that. Uh -huh. What, what, hmm. what? No, you no, say because that time, I, yeah, I, I just think relationship and that versus a one night stand is different. You know what I mean? I just feel like. So it's, if you meet somebody, you're, you're, you're online dating or something, you meet somebody, you feel each other the same night, bomb, 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 let something get done. I think that's kind of different. Like, uh, you do friends. have the memory, right? Because you didn't even know the person. You probably don't even know their damn last name, honestly. So that's different. It's going to have a different connection. Than if it's a friend, you moved on to a relationship, you all been together, then break up. You want to say now? You wanna hold yeah, on to so I was in a, a relationship for like a year and three months. Okay. In the entire time, his best friend was his ex. See, no, best and that's Jewish. what I just, I don't even know female best friends. I, I don't like this that. This is where my kids start now. I won't fuck with a yeah. female best friend. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. She it's, gotta go. It, no. You're not talking to me. No matter how long. It's, it's not you No talking. matter how long. It's yeah. not for you talking to. Like I said, <laughs> no. No, this, I like, agree. this is the one that we're on the opposites with. I don't care how long, you wanna know why? Because it's like, if y'all so great as friends, 
just like you said, what's the one thing that's keeping you apart? Now, if she butt ugly, you just not whatever. I might, <laughs> that might be a little flexible. But if this girl looks like a freaking Victoria's Secret model, and y'all best hell no. No, hold on. Huh. Let me tell you now. Why. Let me tell you, <laughs> tell you why. And this I don't is, care how she look, really. I this, care. I don't. I care. I don't. I care. Okay. It's, okay. This is I look how I look for. Wait, wait, wait. If it's a beat up girl, hold up. I know that, but it's like if she looks like you, I can fight. I. <laughs> She's like, yeah, that's She's like, don't mind. But maybe she looks like, what if she looks like his type? And it's like, well, why are you guys? Fr- I don't like that. That's just weird. I understand yeah. why it would make you. I understand <laughs> why it would make you feel weird. But I think depending on how long the person has known, the, and this is this is the whole conversation that is a different topic. The whole guy girlfriend thing, mm-hmm. right? I think it can exist. I think it does exist in more areas than people really want to admit to. But we just have this taboo on it, right? That dude might just be. She, th- yes, she's attractive, but is she his attractive? Yeah. That's that's two different things. Could be though, because y'all be but keeping no. it a secret. Like, well, I'd like her. Forget friend, the secret. But she's always looked over me, so I'm gonna just play the friend role. <laughs> Let's be real. Then, Let's be very real. A lot of men that's playing the friend role, the best friend stuff. All that girl gotta do is give you one chance, and you guys. What's wrong with that? Stop. What you, What's wrong with that? What the problem Wait, with that stop. is? Because I thought no. about that this week. Let's the talk. problem with that is mm-hmm. now it's like it doesn't make the friendship genuine. Why? Because you're really only friends hoping that you will get a chance. This, that part of the hoping part is a part you of hope, believing. Let you me tell you why. Wait, wait, that no, one no, day no, no. she will let that's, you No, 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 no. If somebody, if a guy genuinely, genuinely says, if we're talking like, yo, D, that's my friend, but if she hears me, I really hope she, that's yeah. different. I'm just saying, wait, wait, hold on, hold on, let me explain. If this guy does not have thoughts of that, right? But he's single, she's single. He's not even thought about her sexually. And she starts touching him or whatever and, and you know his body starts to react and then it goes somewhere why am i blaming him for a natural instinctive no, action if they're sexual if the, how is the situation though oh. and they were friends they were friends and for some reason she she's she feels vulnerable she feels whatever. if my guy friend if i'm talking to my guy friend and he started touching me and i get a re- i'm i'm not i'm not i wouldn't even get the reaction let's start there because right. it's like so, i will i just do not see you that way i will never part of see my that point way. that that it, it is possible no you're not, you're not budget, but it's but moving it's my point like, when you say that it's different for us like women and men is so different like these men could really be your friends for years and still want to fuck and us women we don't see them that way and they're like uh, we, i see you as a brother like i wouldn't even but i believe type shit. i believe with some guys well then that backs up my point that's why i don't I believe y'all some, friends with no girls because if that's some, the case if it's you what still i believe I, some guys that's no. that's why i always say it depends that's why i always ask how long have they been shit. friends have they known the girl before you and has they ever talk. these are questions talk about me these are questions <laughs> if you're a girl you should be Bro, asking this shit was hold on what? That's what that was. <laughs> Those people violated me, bro. They, just, they was scared. talking about me. All the That's what they do. Me. Y'all go see a little female. Boy, I need a female perspective. No. But you're getting, you have you're a getting mother. Yeah, but it's, no, no, no. no. Wait, 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 wait. It's the same thing if it's no. a guy to do, though. No. If it's, a, if it's a guy best friend, they'll talk shit about you the same way, though, if, if that's what they want to do. Well, I'd rather you do with some guy that <laughs> I don't give a crap about. But that's your insecurity. That doesn't mean that you're That's not an insecurity. Women are, no. Your lack of trust. No, you talk a lot of shit. Thank you. And you got to start disrespecting me. Bro, you got to. Y'all, one thing about old single men, you correct me if I'm wrong. You will vent, you can vent, you can vent to Mackenzie about me if we're dating, right? All the time. Mackenzie's just gonna be like, damn, she's a bitch, man. Fuck her. That's the type of stuff y'all said, or y'all just sit down and listen. Uh, Some uh, are most like that. Cause for girls, we be quick to be like, F men, right or not, that, that's what we do. Yeah, I get that. So F with me? But if you're, if there's, if there's <laughs> something that could, <laughs> me? if there's something that, and you got some girls saying F me? If there's trouble in the relationship. X at X. Oh Lord. If it's an X, that's one up on me. If it's an X, no, now it's totally different. If it's an X, that's you know they got it. Why you know? You just ask me. You want to be friends? That means you want me talking about my ass. Remember, this is two different things we just touched on. The X being a friend, that's the first part. Yeah. I was just talking about females non, in general. Yeah, females in general. If it's an ex, of course. I'm I feel like even with females in general, and then I'm shaking this girl's hand, like you bring her, oh, it's a childhood friend. You just talk mad crap about me. And she joined with you. No, no, it's no friend. You, I, I can it's see them do that in the way they're supporting their friend. Maybe y'all are better together. Yeah, maybe that's what it is. 
And Honestly. If they, if they make because if you're such good friends, why are you not together? I, I don't get that. Because they just don't have the pieces of whatever they need uh, to be together. They prefer to be with you. I have it. <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> 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 Uh, they know that they prefer to be sure. with you. You have whatever it is that I mean. It could be something. It could be something. They don't gotta be just like crumb de <laughs> It could be just that one quality that, that 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 girl has that he. That's just his friend. He just like you said before. You can't. But she just see said men will her. never yeah. just be friends. Now remember, she gives him an opportunity. Remember, remember, I'm not talking if about all men in general. If it's that same energy from the jump, then it's not going to be. That but I, I just, I, I, I still defend that. If somebody come on to you, you're a single dude. It's your friend, and but because why? Okay, why is somebody excused right to meet a stranger in a bar and things things happen? I had a few drinks, and then boom, we end up in a hotel room. But if it's your friend, right, and something happens, things happen, and then we got the decision later. Why nobody wants to accept that? No, because then you can't. There's still a body. I'm not back. denying it's not you weird. It's back. weird. It That's is. Good that you but I'm saying, like, it, it, it's weighed on the same scale. Especially if it was good. But it's all get you go back. Go but then they might be together. <laughs> oh my then, oh then, yeah, that's my girl again. I put my penis in her vagina a couple of times and it was great, but. You added, you added stuff. A couple of times was crazy. A couple of times is crazy. I, I, I know. Then you know what I mean? But it come to me talking about some oh shit. A couple of times is crazy with benefits. That's totally not even a No, but you could be. Yeah. That's an ex though. Nah. That's an ex. An ex is somebody you did it a couple of times with and now you're friends. But I would say we got to separate Man, the two. I got to look like Ronald McDonald. Pass me the free freaking red wig and give me the makeup because I'm a Listen. fool to even think that that's okay. Do you feel like it's disrespectful if you get a new partner to remain friends with your ex? Exes? Bro, how are you gonna be asking people to just stop being friends with people? That's sounds How? Crazy. Like this, cut her off. That, that's, that's, it's not gonna work. Cut her off. Especially if you're a new person that it's they just have to, to get to learn. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, it, I'm really thinking no. that it really if is it's not happens. Happens. Do you want her or yeah. do you want to be with me? Yeah. And if, if you want to be with me, you're going to do what you got to do to be with me. So it's like, Yo, it's, I love serious. that y'all just brought that up. This oh, is God. a very poignant part. Oh, yeah, y'all went too far. Y'all went too far. <laughs> we did not even know. Ah, shit, we messed up. That's all right. That, part, that I'm going to hit you with something so hard that I got hit with, and it was a poignant part in my life. Epiphany. What? When my current wife and I were just dating, right, I asked her if your mom and me would have fall off a ship. Who would you save? She'd have to, she should save she you. She said her mother at the time. We were dating for a while. <laughs> well, the, the same way you were like, who? I stopped and she kind of explained, well, you know, it's her mother and I've been with you, let's say it's probably about the two year mark or something, right? Mm -hmm. And she explained why. It's my mother, blah, blah, blah. She helped me, blah, 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 blah. I get and then I was like, damn. But then I stopped and I thought about it. I was like, as time progresses, now we're married, right? It's I asked her again. Of course. And it was me. So back to what y'all are saying. You can't be the new girl and be like, cut your girlfriend off. No, yes, I can. No, you can't. Okay, well, hey, make me feel some time away. Thank you. No, gotta you go. know what? I take that back. I and should we be knowing. I honestly, shouldn't say you can ask. Knowing. You should be able to ask, but deal with the consequences. No, I feel like. <laughs> it, it, deal with the consequences because you might be like, no, listen. You, my question is going to be, what are you holding on to? Though. <laughs> He's not holding on to nothing. He's, it's just yeah, you're a holding on to something. If it's, it's just, just a friend, you should be able to. The friend should understand that you have a girl now and she's not comfortable with the fact that y'all had sex and our friends now. This is what I would like, say. Like, that simple. This is what I would say. And the that friend should be understanding. Now. Come on, the, bro. She should be no, understanding. The friend should, friend. this is what I think is understanding as a friend in that situation. Backing up. Not, backing up to a point. So, mm -hmm. not calling crazy hours of the night. Not trying to be hanging but out. That's it, friends. Wait, 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 wait. Not trying to be hanging out like y'all used to be hanging out. Talking, See? You treated her like a girlfriend. <laughs> no, I, I don't like because that's when you're about to do the same. You're treating her like an no. ex. Like, hey. <laughs> no. So if if I was doing the same thing with a man, how would you feel? Exactly. Damn, y'all. I, like, I, I see the same man. way either either way. Yeah, I either way. Girl. So a man put his penis in me. Wait, 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 wait. How are we get to the you're penis? Splat. That was the same thing we were saying. So now it's cool. Like you have to hang out with bro at 3 a.m. Listen, we're we're on the phone. I'm not picking Internet up. Hang out world. Internet in the world. Internet in the world. Let's get it straight. <laughs> Penis enter on either side. No matter who. I do agree that it shouldn't get there. I'm just saying I would still accept it as human nature if it happens like that. I wouldn't say that he was waiting like 
Sneaker. No, you're not answering my question. I'm saying, how would you feel? Yeah. I mean, of course you'll be bad. Of course you'd be like, damn, I knew this shouldn't have been friends or they're not really friends. But is it really accurate? Your feelings so are what is it's a different thing. You got to. Oh, oh. got to. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Until you get to the point. Let me tell Let me tell you. Let me, <laughs> let me tell you something, right? You know how some, some, some dudes are like, bros, uh, we're bros open hoes, right? And then he meets this girl. And then hang out, hang out. And then it's more time with the girl, less time with the friends. More time with the girl, less time yeah. with the bros. And then before you know it, he's on his knees. That takes time. Yeah. Then it's then it's not about then it's I about she is the priority. But if she was trying to get him to detach from his friends in the beginning before they can grow and grow if and get talking, stronger, then that that's different. The if we're talking, I'm not expecting you to be at that point. You should be lining the bitches up and telling them there's a, a main one who is about to be the main one. So gotta, I'm gonna need you to line them up, call the meeting, yes, huddle hey. together, yes, do whatever hey. you need to do. So yes. by the point when we become officially boyfriend girlfriend. That's done. I All of that, it's finished, okay. baby. So this is where you believe you have control. Let me put you in a And I might flex if you knew her from a baby or something. It's like, Damn, you gotta do a baby? You gotta be the same I hospital if like- If you knew her as a baby, <laughs> I, I might flex. But even then it's like, there's boundaries. Cause y'all not gonna be all oh, hanging out all hours of the night or what, cause this is what we always do. No, We're not I'm doing saying that. that's supposed to be control. Like, you're not supposed to be hanging out, but to ask them just to cut them off. That's my problem. Asking them just to cut them off. I don't think- This is, I'm talking just for friends. For exes, oh, no. who are exes, getting cut off. Oh, exes, I don't care. Off. I don't care. You are, you're, you're done. What I are you holding on that. to? That's the question. What are you holding? Oh, I knew her before you, and you're going to know her for the rest because I just- I'm trying so hard not to talk about people's business. Hey. Talk to business. We don't know this. <laughs> we don't because know this. My friend has a and the guy oh God, very vague. They broke up, right? And then, you know, she, they weren't together for a while. So she saw other people and whatnot. Mm -hmm. But my guy was always a freaking mosquito in the ear. Always. And I'm like, every time she mentioned like she, she the, the person was around or we hung out, or oh, oh, she's in conversation, she brings up his name. I was like, She's still talking to you. Guess what? After about two years, back together. Yeah, it'd be like. I'm like, hold on. No, but I'm talking about when she was with people too. He was still there. Like, yeah, and this is why we said for the And then and, and they were still they were still <laughs> doing the like business. Yeah. One thing changed. They were still doing the business. So. so that's why I'm like, them exes need to be exes in the <laughs> And I also think to go back to my other question, I think it is disrespectful. If you have an ex as a friend and you got somebody new. You, I shouldn't even have to ask you, bro. Your first thing should be cut that off. Very disrespectful. Very. No, you're not friends. But you we like to pretend, we like to friend. pretend that women don't hold on just in case. They do. They make it seem you know, like they so do, crazy. And that's why you need to cut her off. That <laughs> relationship I was talking about, mm -hmm. they never told me they dated. Never in life. That's I found out. Oh, that's that, that is. They just that. never. Yo, I was See, never. See, and there's friend. a reason why they didn't say anything because it's inappropriate to have a friend as an ex, especially if you're single. Okay, do you? But you get you have some. They had a purpose. Why are to you? Hold, with you did that. Hard, yeah, you did have a purpose. Because you know she would have been mad if she knew about it. Right. So and they didn't want to break it off. Y'all in cahoots mm. with each other. You're like, oh yeah, let's talk to our Let me tell yeah, you something. I mean, I mean you like, really yeah. not gonna know mm. unless <laughs> she hits the fan and gets splattered. Nah, I beat this shit. Yeah, the way and you know it. I was like, nah, you had to be together. Yup. Oh, so you discovered it? Yeah, you got it. We be knowing. We know. We be knowing. After the fact, sometimes. Is it really knowing after the fact? And would that be. So <laughs> after the fact. It is the truth. I, no, because we get a hunch in the beginning. We get a hunch in the beginning. Yeah, but why? And then you... we dig deep. And this is. Oh, hunch. America. This is why the, the, the marriage rate in America is 50%, because 50% of y'all get hunches and still marry people. That's all I got to say. I agree. And Look at her. That's <laughs> another topic for another day. The difference is, I don't. Baby, I'll break up with you on a hunch. That's me. <laughs> I have done no. it and I will do it again. Yo. <laughs> and I'll do it again. Margin <laughs> of error. That's my Margin error. Margin of error. Margin of error. Yeah, baby, I get it. Because as your girl, I shouldn't be having no hunches. True. You actually have no hunches. How do you know that's not something that so you do? It's with. not. You, 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 as a woman, you. No, 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 no. As a woman, you know when you mean crazy and you know when it's something. You know when it's something. So it's like if I'm getting something. Me too. 
Crazy people don't walk around saying I'm crazy. Y'all get mental. Get mental. I'm so sorry. Crazy people don't be walking around saying I'm crazy. I'm just saying. No, but we we know when we're being ridiculous. We know we, we just don't want to admit it. But women know when we off the ball. No. Like, nah, I'd be like, y'all mugging right now. Yeah, you know. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no, you right. know. You it's know. Fake, yeah. So with that being said, baby, if I have any hunches, your little ex, it's oh god. And if you try to keep it a secret, and I find out after the fact, oh Stacy, I don't know how you did it, girl. <laughs> no, I really don't Kill know why I even did that shit. Like you said, you said people. <laughs> 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 she can't remember that. Mm. Like, yeah. 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 Damn. She got maybe I just have to go through that to learn it. True. Oh, honestly, I would never know. Like, what that was like. Yeah, I would, in life, you gotta go through some things to learn. And ever since, my talk really? to a nigga. No, she gotta go. <laughs> and with that, no, you know the timer, the timer, no, you perfect. And with that being said, let us know in the comments <laughs> how you guys feel, Stacy. Thank you so much Amazing. for joining us. Today. Thank you for having me. We hope you come back soon. Oh, I'm excited. You'll get people time. in your DMs. That's what <laughs> they be coming I'm back. Coming what you DMs. talking about, me? I'm like, no, that's it. it. <laughs> I will block you or oh, shit. the fuck out. Period. And yeah, we said cut her off. This will be so. <laughs> leave her off. <laughs> Oh, All right, shit. thank you so much for tuning in today. Let us know in the comments how you feel. Are you yes. friends with your exes? You gonna keep doing that? Are you you slimy and grimy don't like that? Don't do it. Huh? Let us know so we know who to block. Let us know. <laughs> y'all, y'all be you. <laughs> thank you guys for yeah. today. We'll see you on the next episode of Slow to Yeah, Deep we <laughs> <laughs> That's a lot of extra.